Now today we are going to show you how to connect the data logger to the inverter. So this is the typical uh, Shine Wi-Fi X. Um, this is the SN number. And uh, all you need to do is, uh, did you see, if you twist this, they always have an arrow. So make this arrow towards to you. And then you pop up to the connection, the USB port. And straight up. Yeah, and then at this when you feel it's already go on, all you need to do is twist the clockwise. And how to remove it is just anti-clockwise. And when you actually see that, then then you pull. Simple. And then once you click, you should feel you couldn't click anymore because as you turn, it, it's fully fixed. And then now you see the color is multiple color. That's what we want. But when you actually connect it, you have to be for solid blue. So now I switched off. Because the first time when you whatever you be put it on at the first side, it will take some time for the data logger to to use to the system. Yeah. Now we just wait. We just wait until now we could see that solid blue. Now is the time we Today I'm going to show you how to register our GrowAt account. So once you are the customer, you just need to log into the software and here should be totally empty information. All you need to do is just press register and then uh, we have the star marks. That's all the important bit to be filled in. And here I will take you through. So the country is just the origin, just pick your own country and region. So currently I live in um, UK, so I just basically press UK, um, United Kingdom. And then the username is the, the number which is for your own account. And the password, the both information have to be private. And with those information, you have to fill in by yourself. And the phone number you don't have to give. The email is compulsory because the email is for the replicate for the verification to be sent out to the email. And then you will be able to get the account back once you uh, forgot your password or information like this. And then the installer code, if you have from your installer, whoever the company installed for you, they should have their allocated uh, installer code. So the installer would be able to through this code uh, to basically help to you to monitor the devices and then be able to help you further while you are actually in doubt of any services which you're not sure of. And when you actually complete all and then you have to press agree the agreement and then press register. And after you press register, then what will happen is they will send to you an email for the verification. And then once you actually approve the form from your email and you will be fully agreed, then you will be uh, have your own um, username and password. Then when you actually go back here, you can put your own the username and password, then you can log in. This is the Shine Phone app. When you actually log in, you'll be able to find, and then you just put your username and your password, and you create the terms, then you log in. Once you are inside, then the dashboard, they have plant, they got go home, services, and me. And now, when you actually go into the plant, I already created, uh, created the plant. If you are new, you just add a plant and you enter the uh, star marks, the information. Once you complete everything, then you just basically add plant and it will bring you back to the page. As I already done, so I just log in to one of them. And then I currently, I don't have any device. Um, I just basically add this device and then I scan the QR code. And now this is the information, which is exactly the same as the backside of your data logger. All you need to do is just press confirm and then pick hotspot mode. And now this step is just to double check that it is actually a blue light. 
a steady blue light. Now just press next and then go to set. When you press go to set, the data logger as a number, that's what I need. So I just enter it in here as one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Every new device you have to enter this password. And once you're there, they basically will say something like connecting. Now oh, they said it now is connected. And then all I need to do just go back to the Shine Phone app and just return it. And now I have to make sure the asset number and my hotspot name are the same. Then I proceed further. So be careful. Here they said the configure network. Here it doesn't mean configure network. Here it just means configure the data logger. And then now is where you put configure your network. Now this time you just basically pick your home Wi-Fi. So that's grow and energy is our and then I just put the password here. And basically once I actually I have to make sure I don't have an, a big letter difference. There's no any extra space. All the information I've been entered in are correct, have to be exactly the same. And then I double check that have to be solid blue, then I press configure. And then you just stay by one place and wait. It will connect by itself. This time may take slightly longer and all you need to do is just wait a little bit. Now, basically, that said, the digital log configured successfully. And now, all you need to do is just return to the power station and uh, you drag anywhere and you'll be able to see and monitor. Normally, this is you show it up, but then we have a um, five minutes interval for the recording time. So, this normally takes about five minutes to see the real thing. And now, you see now I could see some of and then if you actually drag it again just keeps dragging then you will see more and more information and that's it thank you very much